That was intense. Turns out the Big Bad Cojones was a cyborg. This new level of technology, a machine that is indistinguishable from human form, has some seriously messed up implications. Oh, it also had a radioactive bomb contained inside of it, ready to be activated at dawn. Naturally, I didn't let that happen. Scientists later determined that the bomb would have detonated if at the scheduled hour, it had retained a glimmer of energy. The Android Rebellion never happened. With no signal marking its beginning and having destroyed their main leaders, the whole thing was DOA, dead on arrival. Sure, in the aftermath there were some serious altercations in Bot City, but it didn't take long for my degenerate city to return to what it called normality. What I still don't understand is that the cyborg hinted that Roy might still be alive. It accused him of betraying everything I thought he stood for. It spoke as if it knew me. I know it's impossible. There was an official funeral for Roy. One I couldn't attend because I was in hospital, but it happened. The whole department was there. It can't... Roy... I won't rest until I know for sure. Cyborgs be ready within a month and a half. 
I think you'll find these creations to be rather special. For your sake, Doctor, you'd better make sure of it. The prototypes used at Tamanaka Plaza were disappointing. I assure you, the new models will suit your requirements. I expect nothing less. Sir, what about the girl? She... Do you have plans to ensure she will not interfere again? That is none of your concern. It is a personal matter.